Hey guys, what's up? I'm doing a new toy review of a Monsuno clip. Now then, this Monsuno clip is pretty cool. I've been waiting quite a while to get this. Ordered a few days ago. Or got it a few days ago. I did a few reviews. Didn't work out. Bloopers will be... I will make a video of bloopers when I have made 50 bloopers. And then I'll put them into one video. And then I'll show you them. There is quite a few. One of them was of lock spinning into my face. But let's not get into that right now. Right now, it is the turn of the Monsuno clip. Now then, I think that made a bit more light, did it? Maybe you are the viewers at home. So then, call one, two, three, four to tell me. Nah, I'm kidding. I don't have a number that you can call so that tell me if there is or if it is better or not. Now then, here it is. The clip. As you can see, you can fit two Monsinos. One, two. I'll show you that later. I took the Monsino sticker off, but it always has it on. Um, I don't like it on my Monsino toys, because I think it kind of makes it a bit bad. But it only comes with the Monsino sticker up there. Um, it has a Cortex symbol right here. It's kind of cool. Bolts, 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 a whole heap of bolts. Um, back here, it's pretty hard to see, but right here, it says Monsuno. And also, you hold on from there, then open it up. Now then, on the thing, on the um, packet, it says it can fit 10 cards. I have proven that it fits more. Well, not yet, but I'm pretty sure that I will prove that it fits more. Right now I have five, and I still have a whole heap of space. And I'm not sure, but I think that this part, you can put the card there and say, like, when your next move is that card, put it there and say, like, you're waiting to play that card and just leave it there, because it has, like, this little holding part there and there. So I'm pretty sure that that's what it does. I'm not sure, but yeah. Um, obviously, it has this part because it's clipped so that it can clip onto you. Um, yeah, I'll demonstrate um, a few two cores. I'm going to take lock, whoops, and shadow lock. They're cores only. Right now, I didn't fit the Monsinos in. There's lock, and there's shadow lock. Or as in the cartoon, you might want to put lock and evo. And evo. So yeah, that's what it looks like. Then you can fit all their cards in here. So I'll grab these two. Now I'm gonna I am gonna put them in here. Because now what I'm gonna do is put all my, say, my favorite guy is Chase, from the cartoon, so I, what I want to do is put all the cards of Evo, Shadow Lock, Lock, and soon to be Elemental Lock, into here, so that I can just have them as an accessibility easily, not have them in a whole pile. So yeah, so that's what I'm going to start doing. First I'm going to sort it out by, say, Lock. Shadow Lock, then Evo. So now I'm gonna put them in, and ta-da! Mots, you know, Mots are powered in your hand, or whichever hand you're playing with. Then I'm gonna put Inner Shine. Ta-da! Now I'm gonna put Thunder Barrage. Uh, ta -da. So yeah, my clip is ready. Oh wait, just one last thing. Here's Lock. Fold up his legs. Put him 
in. Here's Evo. Fold up his wings. Fold up his wings, his feet, and his tail, and his head. Put him in. So yeah, in my future Monsino videos, expect to see this like right on the side. I'm gonna put it just right there, probably. I'll see where I'll put it after this video. I will make some new videos. Tell me what other Monsinos I should review. Remembering, I collect Chase. If you have any information about Chase Monsinos other than Lock, Evo, Elemental Lock, and Shadow Lock, I know about all of those. Yeah, that would really help me. Um, thanks for watching, and bye-bye. RJ, out.